then the big issue was women entrepreneurship. Okay, and here we've struggled. We've struggled to find what are the interventions that can actually make a giant difference. Maharashtra government said, no. Uh, what would a woman's uh, a woman entrepreneurship policy look like? No state has one. Can you help us, you know, draft a woman's entrepreneurship policy? And along with that, a scorecard that measures actually whether the state is making progress on that. So that's one. I don't think this is a game changer. Well, okay, it gets us immersed in the issues and with the set of actors. Then we took on the project of uh, the Women Entrepreneurship Portal. But the idea is to create a really useful portal where women entrepreneurs, but all entrepreneurs actually, can come to to access resources of their resource. The third one is to take uh, large e-commerce sort of marketplaces and make them more friendly for women, women entrepreneurs. We work with what, Urban Club and Amazon to start with. And the idea is to try and understand what it's going to take to mobilize and onboard more of these. Fourth one is uh, NRLM, where um, the idea is that NRLM wants to give loans to uh, 10,000 women entrepreneurs. So we've taken on this for partnership project with NRLM and the focus is on three states, Maharashtra, Madhya Pradesh and Rajasthan. Not only really do we need to find the right women to women entrepreneurs to extend the loans to, but also what is the support you give them after that to make sure that the enterprise is successful. So the mentoring, the, uh, the, the peer networks, the, the markets, all those things are crucial, not just the loan.